Hi everybody, it's Donna and Angelina. We are in Falls Church, Virginia. Oh my gosh, and it's so beautiful. I wanted to uh, go live and share a little bit of it with you. Let's see, am I going straight? I yes, you're going straight. I was just making sure I didn't have a stop sign. This is really bouncy because I need to fix the thing. Oh, so you know, this is getting like industrial, not like it was. Oh, this looks like it's that other side of town again. I think we, I think we picked the wrong one. I picked the closest one. This was the closest one? Mm -hmm. It's so pretty. What's pretty? Just this area is so pretty. Like, this is like, I like how everything's can you brick. Put, yeah, everything's brick. So we're like seven minutes outside of Washington, D.C. Hey, Swamp. Hi, you guys. I don't know who's in, you guys, because I'm driving. And I can't really see the... um. It's red. It's I, red. It's red. I know it's red. And I'm like an unfamiliar territory here. Yes, we heard the Johnny Depp news. We're really happy about it. So I only have Bo with me. We got here about, um, oh, this is called East Falls where we are right now. We'll take you back to um, Katie's neighborhood in a minute. We're just going out and getting Chick-fil-A. Chessie's back at Katie's house, at my friend's house. Um, so, hold on a second. I'm so not used to, I'm so not used to driving. <laughs> I'm so not used to driving like in like the city like this. Wait, mama, mama, mama. What? I see it. Holy crap. Just I wait. Know. Just wait for these people. Oh, you mean wait for these people to like move their car? Yes. You think I should go around them? I don't know what these cars are hauling. Oh, yeah, there's the no hell. way to go around them. Okay, so we, um, we're actually just going to Chick-fil-A. Chessie's back at the house. We had a little bit of a rough night last night. We spent a few hours in the emergency room. So Chessie's got something going on. They they did a bunch of tests. Again, abdominal pain. When these kids complain of abdominal pain, I just collapse. But um, they did some some X-rays on her, and they gave her some. They didn't. They don't know what's wrong. Um, I, I asked her if she wanted to turn around and go back and she said no let's continue forward so we are continuing forward um, they gave her some a medicine for ir irritable bowel but I don't think that's what the problem is watch out for this person I see her bow it's not my first day driving okay, well you're talking and you look oh yeah this is the part of town that we came you're in you're supposed to take a left there so. oh Okay, hold on a second. So, let's see. Oh, yeah. This is not... Oh, look at those... They're like selling cowboy hats on the side of the road. No, oh, that's it. That says no U-turn. So, is is it over here? Well, no. Now we have to go a whole different way. Okay, hold on. Let's just go... It's very stressful. You're stressing me out. Um, anyway, so here, let me turn this around. So um, they gave her some medicine for irritable bowel, but we don't know if that's, we don't know if that's what it is. So today was kind of rough driving here. And when we got here, we all kind of just chilled out for a little bit. My girlfriend has a beautiful home. My friend Katie, who's hosting us. We have like our own apartment in the basement of the house, but it doesn't feel like a basement. It's it's awesome. She lives seven minutes outside of Washington, D.C. in this beautiful neighborhood. Like this neighborhood isn't beautiful. Like this is kind of like really like the rough part of town. But excuse me. So we're just going out and grabbing some Chick-fil-A and going to bring it back. Um, Chessie didn't want to come. She didn't feel well enough to leave, which is kind of concerning because you know we're in like a new town and I wanted her to feel good but yeah so traffic was
wasn't answering it. Can you um, call him on your phone and see what he wants? Spicy chicken food for Kathy. Oh, okay. Um, oh, thanks, Kathy. So, sorry. Do you want those plastic bins gone? Yes, the plastic. Yes. Yep, off the porch they can go. Bye bye. Um, I guess that's it. There's nothing else for me to report. We just uh, we drove almost seven hours today, and you know it was kind of sad because Chessie was in, in pain, and hopefully uh, it will get better. Turn the camera around. The sun is like shining right on us. Hi, Maddie, how are you? So I have to pay attention to this GPS and I'm so not used to driving in the city. Do they have homeless signs on um, in their hands? Yeah. Somebody gave him some food. See, he's carrying a big loaf of bread. Yeah. Right. Let's see what my friends are saying. Oh my God, seven hours, yes. And there's so many nice little restaurants in, in this town and we're only staying here one night because then we head to Boston tomorrow. But- You're gonna take a U-turn. There's no way to get into- Take the, a left. We, are we going into that parking lot? Yeah, but you have to U-turn to get into it. Oh, there's no entrance mm -mm. here. Is that so strange that there's no entrance like right there? Yeah. Okay, it's telling me to U-turn at the light. Uh-huh. How am I gonna U-turn here? There's no way, that, there's no way I can U-turn here. There's not even like a middle medium there's or a, anything. There's a light for the, the turning, I think. It says, it says to turn right here. Yeah. Bow. Go. I can't U-turn. You see the traffic coming? I mean, I know that the GPS is telling me to U-turn there, but I, there's no U-turning there. That's like prohibited to, to U-turn like that. So gonna have to see if we can find an actual u-turn or street that we can go down how about right here is this a u-turn yes I think this is a u-turn okay right here I'm gonna put this put this around oops keep it around there was like no u-turn It's gonna fall off. Here, we'll put it on um, the tripod. Because that tripod. Oh, the tripod. Oh no, here it is. Hold on, you guys. Let me fix this. All right, the light just turned. All right, how am I gonna do this? You don't know how to do it. Bring it off. Sorry if I'm giving you motion sickness. Okay, that that's good. That's perfect. Okay. Is it um does it have a drive-through or are we going in? There's probably a drive-through. Not here, not here. Am I going here? No, no, not here. It looked like it was telling me to go there, didn't it? No.
You know when you, you're looking at the GPS, you guys, and you've got like two roads that run like par parallel with each other, and like you're not sure if the GPS is telling you to take that road or not? I hate that. I hate when that happens. Is the sun blinding you guys? Look at how pretty the sun looks on on the screen. It's so and bright. It's blinding in person. There's no one talking. Did you disconnect it or is it still live? It says live. Guys, are you there? Can you hear us? Oh, there you go. There's somebody. Who's that? D. Hewitt. It's pretty. Yeah, it is pretty. Okay, ready? Let's not miss it this time. Okay. Safeway. That must be a supermarket, right? There's a Dunkin' Donuts, a Subway. Oh, is that Chick-fil-A right in front of us? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Are you going to go in? No, it's drive through Oh, there's a drive through There's a lot of places up in the Northeast uh, don't have drive throughs I think it's a drive through I don't think so. This is like an old plaza in an old building. There's no drive through This is like, you got to go in. Did you say they have salads? I really am in the mood for a salad. Or just sandwiches. I really wanted to have like a nice salad. They have salads. They're good. They do? Mm -hmm. There is drive through. Oh, maybe not actually. There's no drive through. That's depressing. Well, get used to it because there's not going to be a lot of drive throughs up here in the Northeast. I'm going to park here. Okay. Just pull up into that one. Oh, they have curbside orders. No, it's fine. I'll just go in. Want me to come with you? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> I'm going to leave you guys going. I'll be right back, you guys. And then I'll take you through the neighborhood back to You're the gonna house. You're going to leave them on? Yeah, they can chit-chat with each other. Okay. <laughs> they can talk amongst each other while we're gone. I'll be right back, you guys.
Okay, I'm back. I left Angelina in there to get the food. I don't eat at fast food places. I know, but when you're traveling, what are you gonna do? Hi, Juju. Karen, neither am I. My kiddos like it, though. I'm not a big fan of um, Chick-fil-A, to be honest with you. My kids love it. I'm a little late to the live. Where are they? Hi, Amy. We are in Falls Church, New, uh, New Jersey. No, Falls Church, Virginia. I'm sorry. Um, seven. Oh, here she comes. It's um, just seven miles or eight miles outside of Washington, D.C. It's... Um, Hi, Michelle. Hi, Michelle P. The chicken nuggets always look good. What did she order, Donna? Okay, so she ordered a number one for her and her sister, and I ordered myself a Cobb salad. I forgot. What was his name? He said bye. Jason? Jason said bye. Oh, my gosh. The waiter? <laughs> He's, he was so cute. He was so sweet. I gave him a little tip. Did Just, you really? I did. You didn't see me slip him some money? No. Oh my gosh, yes, of course I did. How much? It doesn't matter how much. But he was like, he goes, what's the name on the order? And Angelina goes, and I, and I said, Donna. And he goes, oh, he says, my sister's name is Donna? Oh, what did yeah, he say? My yeah, my cousin's name. My cousin's name is Donna. And so Angelina goes, well, that's not her real name. Her real name is... Um, Donatella and he goes oh he goes my favorite designer is Versace and I said really oh you need to put the um the address in oh I don't have the address you don't it's Ch Cherry Street number f number four Cherry Street um so he yeah so he was like he goes oh she did a whole video on YouTube on how to properly pronounce uh, her name and he goes how do you pronounce your name and I said well I said most American people say Donatella I don't I don't correct anybody I said but the proper pronunci pronunciation is Donatella <laughs> and he's like that's it he was funny he's like that's how you say it that's how she teaches people to say it so yeah he was really cute it was awesome he was. He was so cheerful and happy. Yeah. and He was really funny, too. He was really funny. You were like, when you were, like, describing how um, people said your name in, like, Boston or Mass, where yeah. was it? Yeah, in Boston. You I were said, like, they say with an E-R at the end. Yeah, so when I was growing up, they used, to, they used to call me, if they called me by my given name. Do you have it on the map? I, I'm having Chessie send me her location. Okay. Um... He's like, whenever you told them, he's like, see, you're nicer than me. I would have, he was like, I would have beat some people up. Yeah, Donatella. 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 They used to say Donatella. Um, I have no idea where I'm going. We're like on a side street here. I have to call Chelsea. She's not answering. We need to like, we're like driving around like not having, we have no idea where we are. We're next to a highway. Right. Why isn't she answering? Where is she Oh, maybe I can track her. Oh, I can track her. Okay, I got it. Four minutes. See, I told you. Oh, okay. Which I way told we... you that we went the wrong way. That's why I was so far. Oh, which way do we go? Straight. Straight. You're going the right way. Good job. Oh my gosh, it feels so weird to be in the city. We haven't been in the city for so long. Go to your map and let, what is Kathy saying? Go to your map and hit return to your last destination. Oh, hey T, hi honey. Oh, okay, she didn't have a wrench and I thought it was one of those bots. Oh, what happened? Hi Karen, who oh, didn't have a wrench. Sorry, I'm not looking at the, um at the uh, at the chat because I'm driving alright let me go look for your jam oh yeah don't, don't turn the camera okay don't what no I won't 
my whole booty's out. I know. No, the pink bags are for Hannah and Sarah. T, did I forget the hams at your house that I bought? You would have found them. I bought those jams for um, Katie, Katie's family. I can't find them in the truck. She's in the back looking for the jams. I don't see them. I know, I can't find them. I don't know if we if we left them at, at uh, I don't know if we left them at T's house. We have. Huh? We might have. I don't remember bringing them in, that's the thing. I remember only bringing the peaches in because I didn't want to leave the peaches um, in the hot car. I, and I remember leaving the jams in the car. How pretty this area is, you guys. I'm going to show you some of the houses once we get closer. It's so beautiful. Kind of reminds me of the neighborhood I grew up in. It's really pretty. I'm not used to the potholes. And the bumpy roads. Our roads are so flat. Because we don't have, you know, the ice and the, the snow and the salt to break up the roads. Somewhere in here. Oh, this so this is this is her house. That brick one right there is her house. But I'm gonna take you down here because I don't know if I'm gonna go live tomorrow morning. Um, I'll show you the neighborhood a little bit. I want to show you a really pretty house down here. It really reminds me of um, my hometown where I grew up, which which I'm gonna go to. I'll, I'll show you guys. Look at that yellow house in there. It's so pretty. I wanted to show them the house with the gazebo. Wasn't that down here? I don't know, but I'm really hungry. Hold on. Look at how pretty these houses are. This area that she settled in was really beautiful. I remember when she found this house, she like looked for it. She found it on, on the internet. Oh yeah, this is the house with the gazebo. Look at how pretty this is. It's got this pretty gazebo. Look at the gazebo and look at the house. Isn't that like picture perfect? Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. Take, uh, take a picture. Take a picture of that. There's nobody behind us. Isn't that beautiful, you guys? Oh, did I move? Take it sideways. Take it sideways so I can use it for the thumbnail. No, sideways so I can use it for the thumbnail. Should I back up? If you want. Just a little bit. Okay. Can you get less street? Yeah, like that. There you go. Perfect. All right. Okay, go. You good? Yeah. All right. All right, let's see. Do they have a stop sign? Yes. Oh, gosh, I'm like... I I am so... You guys, I'm so not used to... Like, I grew up in, the, in, in neighborhoods that look like this with, like, all of these kind of winding... Look how beautiful these homes are. With all of these kind of, like, winding, like, roads and and random stop signs and when you don't drive that for a oh, long time she said the jam was in a peach brown bag it in was, the front seat it was in a what a brown oh right here oh my gosh i can't believe that you're sitting right there and you didn't see that are you kidding me i didn't i didn't know what do you mean there's, are you there's kidding there's stuff laying all over the floor <gasps> look at 
Oh, I want that house. Look at how beautiful it is. All right. People are like, who are these people driving around? Look at how pretty that is. I can't wait to show you the houses in Melrose where we grew up, where I grew up. It's just, that's why I love this neighborhood so much. I remember when Katie was house hunting and she- I just love how there's so many bricks. Yeah. And she found this house and she like, actually, I think they picked it out on the internet and, and they were still living up in uh, Reading. Reading Mass is where they owned their house. Do you know where you're going? Um, I'm going left here, right? I don't think so. I think so. All right, do the, do the location and get me back. Gary, where have you been? Yeah, Welcome. just keep going straight. I'm going straight, right? Yeah. Right. Gosh, I love these big old, how, look at this one. How big and beautiful that is. Mm -hmm. So pretty. Oh yeah, see, I told you we're, this is the, this is the big house that I love uh -huh. right here with the gazebo. All right, we gotta look and see. All right. So I, d I did tell Katie that I wanted to go live. I just don't know um, when we're gonna be able to. It's all gonna depend on how Chessie feels and what time we're leaving tomorrow. And there's a really great thrift shop, she said, that's right here in town that she wants to go. She wants to, uh, she's not gonna work tomorrow morning. Uh, that she wants to go to, or she's gonna take tomorrow off. I don't know. Didn't really have a chance to talk to her. Her and her husband had to go out to something tonight, so she's not even home. <clears throat> oh my gosh, the bumps! All right. So we have like our own little apartment down in the basement of this of her home. It's really beautiful. All right, I'm gonna bring the food to Chess. I'm gonna I'm gonna say goodbye to everybody here. You say goodbye to everybody too. I don't know, um, guys. I don't know. Oh, hold on. We're gonna go in and eat. Say bye. Bye. Don't know when we're gonna go live again. I'd like to. Uh, I don't know. Just make sure you subscribed. But thanks everyone for coming and seeing the neighborhood. Sorry I didn't go live earlier. Chessie just wasn't, she wasn't having it. She just d didn't feel good and um, we don't know. Heather, she has abdominal pain, so did you bring the um, jams in? No. no I, I I'll no carry hands. that. I'll carry that. I bought um, I bought Katie and her family these, um, it's called the Dutch Kettle um, Peach Jam and from uh, South Carolina from T's neighborhood and then I bought her this blackberry jam and then I bought her a small bushel of peaches as a thank you for letting us stay here which is so sweet okay I'm gonna go um, I'm gonna go eat I haven't eaten I'm starving so I'll talk to you guys soon okay bye